conference is built around the core question of what is it like to be a farmer in transition to regenerative agriculture? What does it need? What is easy? What is hard? And what is the support that we as an agri-food system, everybody around, whether that's startups, whether that's researchers, whether it's corporate, whether it's politician, what is it that is needed in order to support that transition? One of the special things that we're doing here is we have on purpose 50% farmers and 50% non-farmers. The most important thing that this um, event facilitates is just farmers getting to know other farmers and researchers and people who can help us achieve the goal of saving the world. <laughs> We share a vision that is actually very complex and detailed and we actually share that vision which is amazing because it doesn't just have to do with food and environment, it has to do with economy and it has to do with society and human health at the physical and mental level and the health of community. So all of that. to meet the European farming, regenerative farming community. I'm here to meet and orientate myself towards what's happening in a broader sense in Europe. I'm here at the conference uh, from the farmer side because I feel the need for inspiration to connect with a wider European network. It is the place where everyone is talking about regen, what it means, how can we help each other make this movement grow? I believe the, a change must be done in the way we, we produce, we sell and we commercialize uh, our products. I think we need that that all in the, the agri-food systems change their mindset, yeah, not, not only the farmers. We all are aware of that the agricultural system as we know it today has to transform in order to be able to, you could say, feed the people. It's not going to be enough to till the soil differently. We need to change the whole economic system, so we need another game. My wish is that this could be, my generation will be the generation that um, will live the, the turnaround in the agri-food system. If the future is not regenerative, I'm not sure there is a, a certain future actually. important for us to learn to read our land and so that we can recognize all the feedbacks we get. For me it's about understanding, respecting and nurturing the connections of life. Revitalizing um, not just um, the soil but the whole ecosystem that is around us. When you're working in a regenerative way you are working to build and nourish and respect and enjoy life. I think a lot of people are very disconnected from the land and I think we can, the more we can make that connection, the better. In regenerative agriculture, I've always thought it's about building up soil health, right? It's about adding something positive. You don't have to be a parasite on the earth. You can work together with Mother Nature as it was always intended. <laughs> Don't be scared. Change is coming. You just have to embrace it. Make visible what we are doing here. Let's make it, let's do it, because it's really cool what's out there. Be nice to each other. All of you realize now that you are not alone, that we are going to do this together. It's the only way. So here's to you. 
the farmers. 